goblin. 25 years. Yes. Where did that yeah. happen? How did that happen? Where's that gone? I don't know. I mean, you don't even get that for murder these days. So. <laughs> but no, so, it's, it's, it's... got a new live album, Matt. Is it out yet? Yeah, Is it about um, to come out? Obviously, obviously, there was a lot of uh, shows planned this summer to celebrate the 25 year anniversary. And, yeah. Uh, COVID-19 has now meant that that's sort of all gone down the toilet and you know the band needs something to exist we still have like studio rent to pay we still have yeah. like crew to pay and things like that so we uh, we had a trawl through the archives and we found some material that we thought we'd put together and, and make a decent live album and uh, yeah Rough okay. and Ready Live came out exclusively via our band camp on Friday right. um you get an exclusive track on there. Um, it will come out on all other platforms, Spotify and uh, iTunes, all those uh, yeah. later this week, I think it is. Um, and then, yeah, there's the company and video. And we've just been really busy promoting that, doing live Q&As on our Facebook page every Thursday. We've got a new Spotify channel. We've got a new um, YouTube channel. Just taking this opportunity to, to do all the stuff we never had time for yeah. before, which is kind of updating our online presence and, and being a nuisance, really. <laughs> uh, so, forgive me for not understanding all of the nuances, but is it is it a recently recorded live album, or is it from it, the twenty five years? Have you got an anthology of stuff? That's it's all across. In it's across recordings um, that our sound man did in the last three years. There's a show from right. um, Silac Open Air Festival in France in 2016. There's uh, a show at Coco in London from right. 2016 as well. And there's also a show at the that we did in Athens in Greece last year, and and we put them all together to get that kind of um, track listing that does, as you say, represent everything from yeah. the catalog of the last 25 years. So. so whose job was it to go through all these old shows and listen back to it and go that that version, that yes. version of that song, yes. take it. And Copy. I say it's our sound man, Ches Walton, who, who's, who's done all that. He's he's edited everything with, uh, with the videos. He's. Uh, He's been a bit of a whiz in, in this instance. And, um, yeah, he, he came across all the songs. He twiddled with them, got them sounding as, as best they can, and sent them over to us. And, yeah, then the band uh, listened to it. And we'd all get to, like, three or three four of us would approve a song, but the guitarist yeah. would say, no, nah, my guitar needs to go up there. So, Jez would have to redo that and then send it back and say, what do you think now? And the guitarist would be happy with the bass player. So, and then you can't hear me. <laughs> so, you know. So there's all these sort of uh, going back and forth. But we got there in a pretty, pretty reasonable amount of time to put it all together. And we've had real good help from a friend of ours called Dan Tobin, who used to work at Earache yeah, Records. Sure. He's kind of managed the whole project and been oh, really, uh, really beneficial with uh, promoting it and setting up these Facebook events and getting these interviews and things like that. So, so yeah, it's, uh, it's good. And, and today, this morning, we've just announced um, the 25 year uh, UK and Ireland tour, tour. Yeah. which obviously a lot depends on what's going to happen over the next few months and whether whether live music will even be a thing by then but we decided we, we did consider sort of holding off the announcement because we thought is, is it really sort of important and uh, but mm. I, I think it's I think it's the I do think it's important to give people something to look forward to and give them a little bit of hope that they are going to be allowed out of their houses by the end of the year yeah yeah because it's a pretty grim situation if we're not um so, you know, it's out there. The tickets go on sale this Thursday. We've got shows in Dublin, Belfast, Glasgow, Manchester, Birmingham, Cardiff, and then two nights in London at the Underworld where we're going to be doing special sets each night. Completely different track list, uh, set list. And um, we're not sure what how we're going to go about that yet. We don't know whether we're going to split it into different uh, uh, eras of the band, like the early years. Cool. Or well, whether we're going to just sort of put it to the fans' vote and ask them to sort of, Right. It's their favourite songs and picks picks that list from that. We've, we've got plenty of time on our hands to do that yet. But, <laughs> but yeah, tickets on sand. Um, we've, we've got Spirit Drift from the US coming over as main support. And we're taking Excellent. a great new uh, Cornish metal band called King Creature. As yeah, yeah. Uh, Good so chat. yeah, it's uh, something to look forward to. Well, dare I say, was it self-booked? Oh, of course, yeah. I was <laughs> one of my clients, yes. Good stuff. <laughs> Good stuff. Ben, thanks for your time, buddy. No really problem, Good to Pete. talk to you. Pleasure. Thanks, Thanks for your time, and we'll catch you again soon. Yeah, cheers. Cheers. Mate. Thank you. See ya. Bye bye.